So when I started this a few years ago, I only had the H1 Zoom recorder. Company's name Zoom, link in the description. So this is a cheap and versatile recorder. It has an onboard mic, so you don't have to plug it into anything necessarily. It's good for small, fully sound effects in a very controlled environment where there's no ambient noise and it's all very close to the mics to pick it up clearly. Right now I'm using the H1 Zoom to plug into my lavalier mic because it also works as a great dedicated recorder when I'm not using the onboard mic. In fact, as a general rule of thumb, you should avoid using the onboard mic because any independent mic you buy is generally gonna be higher quality than the onboard mic in your recorder. So here's the DIY portion. This recorder is tripod mountable. So it takes a quarter inch screw in on the back. So you can put it on a tripod and not have to keep your hands so busy. But what I did was I printed off a converter that mounts to your belt and takes a tripod head. So I actually have the recorder mounted to a tripod head and then mounted to my 3D printed belt attachment. So it's now on my person. This is Andy for two reasons. One, you don't have to have a huge tripod with you on set. It takes up virtually zero space. And two, if someone else is running the audio on an actor, they don't have to physically violate them to get access to the recorder. They can simply pick it up off of the belt mount and start or stop it or change levels. The other mic I have that I absolutely love is the H4N Zoom mic, same company. Uh, it's similar to the Tascam. You can go either way. It depends on what your needs are, what your price point is, how much battery life you need. Again, this is a larger recorder. It does have two XLR inputs, so you can do surround sound. The H4N recorder is much better than my tiny H1 Zoom recorder. It has better noise reduction, lossless quality, and it's also tripod mountable. So I can put a tripod head on this give it to my sound technician, and they can belt mount the huge H4N recorder, and then they can use both hands for their boom pole or broom pole. Again, check the description for this one. Well, all right, ladies and gents and others, we are done for the day. Please like, rate, and subscribe. And if you're interested in watching more of these, new microsodes every other day and new full episodes every other Friday.